Alright, Dad. This is my right hand. This is my left hand. I think I told you wrong the first time. I think the piece in your right hand needs to be a little bit shorter than the piece in your left hand. To begin, take the piece in your left hand, go over the piece in your right hand, switch hands, so now this is in my left hand, and the piece that's now in your right hand, you're going to go underneath the to create the knot. Tie it tight. Now the piece that's remaining in your left hand, it would have been the shorter piece when you were putting it together initially, you're going to form part of the bow. So you fold it up against your neck. I'll do that again real quick. Fold it up against your neck. And now all that's remaining is the knot. To form the knot, and this is the tricky part, you go over, and then what you're going to do is you're going to need to find the hole. You need to find the hole, and you're going to need to push it through. And don't, it doesn't matter how it feels, you push it through on the other side, because you're going to be able to straighten the tie up. So now, look at this. I know that's not pretty, but now you just take the bow tie and you just begin straightening it. <laughs> I'm going to look in the mirror real quick. Alright. So now, there you go. And if you need to move the knot, you can shift it left, you can shift it right. But just try to massage it to make it real tight. And mine's not going to fit perfectly because it's actually... The way that I've fitted it is to actually go around my neck when there's a shirt on it, and so it's probably about a half an inch or a little bit less off. So these ends are a little bit lopsided, um, but your shirt should hold it together much better. That's how you tie it.